crocodiles are reptiles because they belong to the class Reptilia. As reptiles, crocodiles conform to many characteristics of reptiles. For example, from the point of view of movement, crocodiles use the way of crawling on land. Crocodiles, for example, reproduce in the same way as most reptiles. Moreover, reptiles are generally poikilothermic, and crocodiles are also poikilothermic. The body of the crocodile is covered with scales and armor, which is also in line with the characteristics of reptiles. Dog is a crocodile or reptile. Crocodiles belong to the class Reptilia, phylum chordata, and are therefore both vertebrates and reptiles. As reptiles, crocodiles fit some of the key characteristics of reptiles. For example, reptiles move by crawling, crawling on the ground, and crocodiles also use crawling. They can not only crawl on land, but also move in water. They can swim. For example, reptiles are mostly oviparous, and crocodiles also use oviparous methods. Female and male crocodiles will mate in the water, and then the female crocodile will go to the shore to lay eggs. Laying eggs in their own pits, not also, from the point of view of body temperature, reptiles generally belong to poikilothermic animals, body temperature is not always constant. The same is true of crocodiles, which are also ectotherms. In terms of appearance, reptiles generally have some scales or horny plates on their bodies. The same is true of crocodiles, whose body surface has more obvious scales, which can be used to protect their bodies. It can be seen that crocodiles, as reptiles, conform to many characteristics of reptiles. Is a crocodile an amphibian? As mentioned above, crocodiles belong to reptiles in the class Reptilia. Amphibians and reptiles are two different animals, they are different classes, so crocodiles belonging to reptiles can no longer belong to amphibians. Crocodiles are different from amphibians in some ways. For example, the classes mentioned above are different. They belong to reptilia and amphibia respectively. In addition, in terms of breathing mode, amphibian larvae generally breathe through gills, while adults breathe through lungs or skin, but crocodiles are reptiles and always breathe through lungs.